Welcome to the Suerte del Molino Farm, Andalusia in Spain. We are in nature. We are learning. We are slow learners. And nature doesn't teach through our rational concepts as human beings. But it teaches us over time. Here we have a Paulovnia. It is about 40, 50 centimeters tall. At the lowest point of the land, we have planted all the Paulovnias exactly the same day, 18 months ago. And there's a tremendous variety in the height of these Paulovnias. So this is the lesson of nature for today. Um, there are many kinds of conditions that certain things prefer and enhances the growth and others that retards it. What it is, we don't know. Maybe if we take time, it will be revealed to us. The natural environment inspector was here because we filled in a form to prune some of these old home oaks. And I've done a lot of pruning on some of them. And then he told us the form was not filled in complete, uh, completed correctly. So uh, he was just visiting, telling me that these Paulovnias are not allowed. So I said, uh, we are not in the National Park, which is about five kilometers from here. And also these are sterile plants, they have no flowers. And he just looked at me and said, okay. So uh, this is why I love Spain. This is why I live here. Things are not black and white all the time. They can also be gray. There is a saying, here are things legal, illegal, and illegal. Legal, illegal, allegal. So, there is some gray area. I'm slowly walking uh, uphill and uh, some of them tiny. On the next well, they're getting already a little bit bigger and then a tiny one. We bought a uh, hundred plants. We received a hundred and four of those. Ninety-seven of them grew. And uh, we are delighted. This is their second spring. And uh, because we didn't prune them on purpose, they're not continuing continuing with one stem they are spreading out this is what I want I want shade these Paulovnias here here they did not outperform or underperform the other trees more or less on par this is a jacaranda 
and this is an, an American oak. Everything here grows much faster than the home oaks or the cork oaks which really take their time. The creek where I take the daily uh, reference for water flow or not. There's still some flowing water. I'm on the eastern side now. This is uh, Paulovnia planted here on the berm with all the other fruit trees a lot of tiny pomegranates that we planted here it's actually from our own stock after we took cuttings from a big tree that was on the farm Nectarines Beautiful Here on the southern border more Paulovnias and uh, planted the same day and some big and some small Here they are bigger than the other reference trees that we planted next to them. Jacaranda. Here on the highest part, a flatter area, we planted some broad beans to see how they're doing and I just think the flies are laying their eggs inside the broad beam they didn't do too well except they did what they were supposed to do according nature is to reproduce each of them had at least one pod or more filled with seeds so nature is happy nature has succeeded we also planted some oats here some seeds I hope more of them will survive the summer and start growing in spring to, uh, in autumn not much of the 25 kilos we planted the previous year self germinated under this huge cork tree we also planted <coughs> some wheat preparing their seed heads they didn't grow too well but they did grow so uh, our learning continues on all the new swales about 500 meters we have planted 500 slips of of sweet potato Let's see how it goes with them. This was one of the 
big surprises. So far, we quickly put in a leaky weir and uh, stones, branches, metal posts, some sand. And we still have a lot of water after quite some time. And the uh, idea now is to take more of the sand and widen this walkway here so that even the excavator can cross here. Amazing! Small changes in on one front makes a huge change on another front. We are delighted. Of all the polovnias we planted, these two are the star performers. And I'm not too sure exactly why. The bigger one is almost three meters. Amazing. We have a lot of fruit trees in the same row. The main idea here was to get some protection from the street. The view, the neighbor's gate is just across. And uh, citrus actually keep the leaves all year round. So we will increase our privacy. Amazing. Well done, Paulovnia. Till next time. Goodbye.